A shocking sight in a Murraysville neighborhood yesterday when a family reviewed their home surveillance video and spotted a black bear on their property. Jessica Gway is live in Murraysville with advice from a state game warden. Jessica. Christine, the family was sleeping when the bear walked through their backyard and down their driveway and a state game warden tells me he's not surprised because they've received calls about several bear sightings in this vicinity over the last four weeks. My mom was like, Rania, we had a surprise guest last night. When Nia Malik and her family checked footage from their camera on the side of their home, they did not expect to see this. A black bear taking a late night stroll outside their house around 2.15 in the morning on Monday. My dad like pulls open his phone, he shows me the video, and it's like a bear, and I'm like, what? Because, I mean, I wouldn't expect a bear, no one would. I thought it was like going to be a raccoon or something. They live in the Settlers Ridge neighborhood in Murraysville with lots of homes, so they posted the video on social media to alert the community, but received some negative responses saying to not post sightings or the bear will be moved and get killed. However, game warden Mike Papinchak says the game commission will only come out if a bear is causing problems. The last thing we would do is just kill it in order to accommodate somebody having one in their yard. They're, they're so easy to live with. Um, that there's really no need to remove them uh, unless somebody starts to feed them and they get habituated to come into a door for a food source. In fact, he says reporting bears to the state game commission is only necessary if the bear starts to become comfortable around people. And since these big guys are not picky eaters, when there's a sighting, he suggests removing or securing food sources. Spread the word to put away your bird feeders, garbage cans. Uh, it's a good idea to lock up your gas grills and stuff because they'll come to lick the grease and things. Nia isn't too concerned about their uninvited visitor. I'm not really an outdoorsy person anyway, so no, I don't think so. I think it's like kind of special when they come out anyway. All of Pennsylvania pretty much has a diverse wildlife uh, on the landscape and, and the uh, uh, bears are part of that. They're easy to live with if we do our part. Another tip from the game warden is if you know there is a bear in your area to make some noise before letting your dog out or going out to your car. He said it's most likely that it'll just keep moving on. Live in Murraysville, Jessica Gway, KDKA News.